Good afternoon, dear viewers of the Noon of Smarters channel and all participants of the Savalmash project. Today, you're in the same name Savalmash studio, and we will talk about very important, I would even say fundamental news about the project. So, each of you knows that today we are getting a construction permit on our immediate agenda. But in order to be able to apply for the permit, we need to complete a certain amount of work. In particular, to pass three examinations, three checks. Let's figure out what these examinations are. The first one is the Moscow State Expert Review Agency. It checks projects for compliance with industrial safety, fire safety, and compliance with all norms and rules established by the Russian Federation. We have successfully passed this examination. The second examination is the federal state-funded healthcare institution, Center for Hygiene and Epidemiology, that checks projects for compliance with sanitary and epidemiological standards. In particular, the agency checks the emissions produced by the enterprise to the air and water. And the third examination is the examination by Rospotravnadzor on the establishment of a construction and operation protection zone. Here we must comply with all the standards and requirements, and not produce a harmful effect on the surrounding territories and areas. As for the last examination, we experienced temporary delays directly related to the COVID pandemic. The deadline for receiving the examination results was delayed by three months. We had been supposed to receive the results on May 1, 2020, but as a result, the opinion report was obtained on July 6, 2020. If we take into account the results of the two previous examinations, we can now conclude that Savalmash meets all the standards, requirements and regulations established by the Russian Federation. And we are ready to apply for a construction permit. A lot of people used to say that this was not possible. A lot of people used to say we would not succeed. But nevertheless, the team of specialists, I would even say professionals, competently fulfilled the tasks assigned to them. And today, we have the opportunity to start the next project stage. And I want to congratulate everyone on this. Hooray, dear friends! Special thanks to everyone involved. And it's not only the specialists directly involved in these activities, but also all the participants and all those who have supported the Sovelmash project. And on July 7, 2020, we are planning to apply for the construction permit. In accordance with the regulations, we are supposed to obtain the construction permit within seven business days after submitting the application. If everything continues as planned, we have a huge amount of work to handle. Because before starting the main part of the construction activities, we need to perform a number of preparatory works. For example, one of them is building a construction camp. It is necessary to create checkpoints and set up washing points to ensure that construction equipment is washed and meets the standards and requirements prescribed by the Russian legislation. In particular, to ensure that it does not pollute the surrounding area and public roads. It's also necessary to provide electricity, hot and cold water and internet connection. All of this must be done before going to the main scope of work. At this stage, I once again want to congratulate all the people involved. Hooray, dear friends! I will never get tired of saying this. And I recommended that you subscribe to the channel, subscribe to our social media, and be informed about all the latest events in the life of the Savalmash project. I'm Alexander Sudrev. See you soon!